Hey guys, welcome. We are back up at Lake Alpine and in this video, we are gonna show you how to do time lapses. Time lapse is extremely useful for showing things that normally humans don't perceive. Geological time, weather patterns, the night sky moving, these types of things move too slowly for us to notice. For instance, you can show a flower opening up and see the lifelike movement that we are unable to perceive. It requires a good bit of planning. You want to understand what your subject is and how it's going to move through the frame. Uh, in other words, if I want to take a wide angle shot of clouds moving by, I want to have a general idea that they will start on the left hand side of my frame and end on the right hand side. For Milky Way time lapses like the one I took, this kind of takes the planning to another level. One really helpful trick is to set up your rig like I have it, get it kind of positioned so everything is ready to go before nighttime. Another extremely useful tool is planetarium software like the open source Stellarium. This powerful piece of software allows you to pick any place on the planet at any time and see what the night sky looks like. This not only allowed me to see that the Milky Way was in the southern sky, it also allowed me to see how the Milky Way would move as the night went on. I could now point my camera in the general direction, knowing that the Milky Way would start here and end there. Once you have your rig set up, you've figured out your field of view, and then the nighttime comes, one trick that is really helpful, you can crank your ISO up as high as it'll go, and then this allows you to sort of fine tune your framing. You can take a quick picture. Obviously this image will have a ton of noise, but you can see what the final image will look like. So that's it for the first part of this tutorial on how to make time lapses. As usual, thanks for watching. If you have any comments, questions, or critiques, please leave them in the comment section. Don't forget to thumbs this video up if you liked it and hit subscribe if you wanna see more videos like this. Thanks, see you next time.